Fred Röke spends every free minute in the Sächsische Schweiz. When the weather allows, she goes rock climbing with her husband, Thomas. It's a passion that unites. Hello, my name is Anne Röke and I come from Sachsen, Switzerland. And I teach climbing. And today I will show you my favorite places. This rock face in Lilienstein is one of those places. Here's where Annette coaches her students and practices herself. The reward for reaching the top is a panoramic view of the Elbe Valley. Down there is another recommendation of Annette's. The ferry takes us across the Elbe to the spa town of Raten. From there it's another 20 minutes by foot to the bottom of the Bastai. This is the location of Raten's open-air theater, which seats 1,800. I used to be here with my grandmother and normally I climb on the rocks and here they use it as a theater and it's a great idea. This afternoon, Annette is watching an operetta entitled The Beggar Student. Performances are staged here between May and September. The plays and operas are performed right in the middle of the national park. And my next recommendation is Hohenstein. In the 1920s, Hohenstein was home to the renowned puppeteer Max Jakob, who thrilled audiences in the local castle with his hand puppets. The workshop where the puppets were made is still in operation today. Gerhard Berger shapes them out of lime wood, just as artisans have for hundreds of years. Together with his son Wolfgang, Gerhard Berger sells his puppets to enthusiasts from around the world. I like these hand puppets because they are uh, handmade from wood, the head, and my mother makes the costumes of the puppets. I like the king and my daughter too. Annette's next recommendation is on top of a hill called Brandt. 870 steps lead to the top. The promontory offers a view over the Sächsische Schweiz to Lilienstein, and there's a place for tired hikers to eat or even spend the night. I like this place very much because of the wonderful view and my favorite mountain, the Lilienstein, and you can enjoy Wonderful Sandets here. So if you ever decide to go hiking or rock climbing in Lilienstein, then make sure to keep your eyes peeled. You may see Annette Röcke just over the next rise.